G'day viewers, Norm here. A few years ago I made a side loader for my kayak, for my roof rack. And I uh, had absolutely heaps of views on YouTube. I realised I let these all down. I didn't show you how I made it. Got some 16mm bar, square bar, solid. And I've got the same 20mm. Thinner wall though, I think the other one's 3 mils is 1.8. Gonna be plenty strong. It was 16 mil bar. It's perfectly into there, up and down, a little bit of movement, not much. Nice and snug, no bashing, just fits. It should be a lot stronger close to the car and the other stuff as well. The 20 mil bar. goes and then I'm gonna um, I'm just gonna pop rivet it so it doesn't slide out it's as far in as it goes I'll just get a pencil just a white pencil I'll just put a mark there so there we have it there's the mark there's a little arrow saying that's the bit that goes in the roof rack there's a nice bit that goes into the um, actual steel. Now I simply just um, insert the bar into the hollow square section. As you can see, it's a nice snug fit. Take that down to that line. So I found a tiny little pot rivet, 3.2 mil diameter. Um, I don't know how deep it is, maybe 5 mil. snug fit with a bit of a bend on it that looks like a bolt one I'm gonna get my kayak out and see how it goes okay so one thing that I do 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 is um uh, side loader again and made cost me seven dollars to any materials um, took me longer to get the materials from the shops and what did to put it together save my shoulders um, yeah thanks for um, watching hopefully you get some good information out of this and you come up with some better ideas maybe for protecting the car other than the towel uh, drop a comment let me know uh, thanks for watching <laughs>